A hologram? It's a projected image that is augmented onto your physical environment. So uh, the glasses have two projectors on them, one above each eye, and that projects images out onto this retroreflective surface. The surface itself is highly directional, so it sends the light right back to the eyes, um, and that's the, the main part of how it works. But there's also a uh, tracking camera in between the, uh, the two projectors, and it has a wide-angle lens on it with um, an infrared filter, so it looks for the position of four infrared LEDs on a, on a fiducial plate and it uses the position of those four to determine your position and the orientation of your head so that we can render the appropriate images out to the two eyes. Yes, and that we'll be, we'll be providing that to all of our Kickstarter backers as well as anyone who buys uh, Cast AR in the future. So everything's written in C++, uh, the software development kit. But uh, right now we're using Unity for most of our demo de development and we're going to be supplying a higher level SDK that will uh, work with Unity for people who want to uh, develop in this environment. It's kind of open-ended. Uh, right now we're sort of focusing on video games just because uh, most of the people in the company are video game developers and have been working in the video games industry for you know, tens of years. But um, where we see this being used to is possibly like an architectural, uh, medical use, training software. Um, I mean, it's, it's endless. So what we want to do is get uh, the dev kits out to people um, this summer. And it's, there won't be any weird licenses for people to deal with. So we really want to see what the indie development community is going to create with the hardware. So. Video games, but also non-video games too, so I don't know. We're, we're still just scratching the surface of what is possible with this technology.